Hi, this is Ellen from Rent Roll Starter. One of the things that needs to be considered when you're starting your own rent roll is where to put your tenant's bond. So you're going to have tenants who are signing leases with your office and paying you four to six and in some cases even more rent as a bond. Different states in Australia have different legislation on where you're supposed to lodge that bond, which organisation to send it to, in how much time you need to send it, and whether or not you can store it in your own trust account. Most states in Australia require that you lodge the bond with the local government's agency, and they will give you a reference number in exchange. And then they'll hold on to that bond until it's time for the tenant to move out of the property and you and the tenant can agree to release the bond to them or to allow some of the deductions for perhaps cleaning or repairs to be deducted from the bond and refunded to you as the agency. Jump onto your local government's website to find out exactly where to lodge the bond and how many days you have after signing the lease to lodge that bond with the local government agency. Now if you need any more information about this or anything else in relation to starting your own rent roll, contact Rent Roll Starter today. Go to rentrollstarter.com.au to register for your free 15 minute consultation about how to start your own rent roll. We'll talk to you soon.